Hello and welcome to the book plays what is to be our form Scandinavia speedrun now that it's not a tech 10 limited formable in all cases question mark I honestly don't know how the mods are gonna respond to this the speedrunning mods but it's something to do uh, Scandi speed form do Okay. So we need to eat. What do we need to do? We need to trigger our missions. Our missions say we need to eat Denmark. We need to... The Scandinavia formable, although we're getting rid of the Tech 10 for, or the Tech 20 formation requirement by clicking our mission tree things, we do still need to own the right provinces, which is Stockholm and 40 of Scandinavia. But let's get to it. Ready, steady, cook. Give them a second to realize they want their freedom. Who hates you? Beautiful. You could not ask for better for that. Give him a sec to realize he wants his freedom. We know this sequence by now. It's this one, this one, this one, this one, this one, this one. Rip monarch points or rip crown land. Uh, that's not happening, but getting rid of our loans might actually happen. We know that we want to sell these because they're huge wastes of money. Ducats. Thank you. No, I want 40 ducats. I want 40 ducats. Not 20. 40. Come on. Ugh, 30 will have to do. Buy my boats. And then we know that we want these to become these. That's about right. Turn off these forts until it's time for war. Oh, sorry, this fort. We haven't had the event that makes this fort pop into existence. Now, if it makes them happy but doesn't give them influence, I need it. Because otherwise I'm not going to be able to get rid of the... Uh... 
get rid of these guys. Okay, so like four more months and we should have what we need in terms of support from the world. No, you should definitely be there. Okay, time to start generating the claim on Novgorod. One more month, start improving with the Pope. Call this back, see who's going to actually support us. Yes, yes, but not England. Two out of three ain't bad. I need to insult you, otherwise we're going to have to pay an extra stab. But I don't have the prestige. So we pretend that we fund the arts. We send you an insult. Give me my freedom. With enough friendly galleys, anything is possible. Go repair. Mm, I think I have to live without being turned off. I'm too poor. How else can I save a bit of money? Actually, that's enough money saved. Get a marriage with you. Get a marriage with you. Check out how your air is. G'day, Oz TV. And Holt has ungodly stats for that. Let's see what stats we have. He's got four times more chance of winning that per month, though, so there's no real point in contesting it. we can do is set one of these to auto diplomats what did we roll for our king bad and the baby is even worse we will throw the baby away
Two of you can ally and shield that. The rest come over there. Over there. They'd try and get that. Fine. Rip. Of course they rebel bomb us. Enforcement costs at least. You should be willing to go away now for money. Get our claim on you. There are a lot more idiots than down the well. There are. Okay. Steal that. Trust that my allies are going to help here. Thank you. I'm going to need to turn on him and eat him pretty quickly. Okay. Fall back. Give me my freedom. This, 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 that. Some people hate us, but not quite enough. Hopefully, hopefully that's livable. should undo that and redo them because we now have claims here and we'll save some points. Yep, enough points to even core it all. And now I have to prevent these people from joining a coalition. And I need another friend. Because Poland by himself is nice, but he don't cut it. So who else is willing? These guys. And then like no one else. Uh, how about no? That's going to have to wait. I need to bribe all these people. Especially Brandenburg. And I think Waldgast. These should go earn us money. The, the, the Germans actually add up really quickly. Because each one brings like 
10-ish force limit. <sighs> really? Sweden's wasting no time. Very well, get over there. You're gonna have to join in. Okay, we've gotten Brandenburg to calm himself down. I do need to claim on you. Well, actually, that's strictly not true. I don't need. All I need to do is eat Denmark. So what I would like is to offer you access and to offer you access. To make sure the Pope loves us. like the rest of that's going to have to wait. Because if I wait much longer, I won't have a CB on Novgorod. Set them as a rival. Same with Sweden. Keep calming Brandenburg down. He does have 10 units somewhere. fort. The free fort is actually really bad. We don't want it. It's a waste of money. <sighs> the only thing that can stop your economy from crumbling is more conquest. With enough war reparations, any debt payment will be achieved. Okay, those two are happy enough. Same with Popey Boy. So we look at the next one. The next one that we care about here is Waldgut, no, Mecklenburg, sorry. We should see if there's a dip. No, there isn't an aggressive expansion. Go away, man. I'll let him fight them. Then they'll bounce onto me and we'll win. Get four of you there. Get two of you up there. GG. Doesn't even have any real garrison. Getting back there is going to be a bit of a pain, but we have transports.
No, they had the capital. These stop them from moving around. These come over here, please. Where? Full state, full core, this stuff. Okay, there's no more love to be had with you. You actually like us enough that you will marry us, so yes, please. Loonberg is going to become very grumpy, so we'll preemptively work on them. Debt's paid off. If we get a noble mission that we can complete, we might even um, be able to we might even be able to get rid of the first of those things that we have to get rid of. nothing we could do. How terrible. Manpower back up to 70% is just... That's one of those never-gonna-happen missions. The alliance with Muscovy is a bit pain. That's 10. So he's like 40. He does outnumber them. I was going to get you as a friend. Who else hates you? No one. So I'm probably best off currying there. Getting the claims on that wouldn't be terrible either. That's it. 
Why vassalize and not all seed to all provinces and release? It's not a big difference. And normally you do that because you're saving the dip from eating the one province. But in this case, it's not a province that we had a claim on. The only difference would be releasing him as a uh, duchy rather than a merchant republic. Yeah, I'll pay that. <sighs> You're right, you do reset this. You no longer have annexed and you no longer have force vassalized, but you also take aggressive expansion for it. It costs more to eat the land than vassalize. There can only be one you. The Highlander style. Tio is an unfortunate one there, but what are you going to do? And I guess we have to have Muscovy. Now, if I need to give away Novgorod to get Muscovy out of that war, then fine. So you know what? Screw our mission. Yeah, I think screw our mission. I do not mind selling out Novgorod for this. month. Make sure you stay willing to join. I want Sweden, Stockholm, or actually I probably want everything here except Stockholm. And maybe a bit of this so that we can reconquest next time and save some AE. So we'll go with Dallas Cargan. Well actually which is the next most expensive? That one. Yeah, it looks like it's Burgess one. Now, Muscovy, how would you like? All of Novgorod. No. Doesn't want Carolenia. Prefers release Novgorod. Okay. What do you want? Done. Go away. He didn't even make me give up my friendship with with Poland. Fantastic. I don't mind giving up Novgorod for having gotten Muscovy out of that war. Probably want to separate my two stacks, yeah. Neener, neener, neener. I 
Okay, now who's gonna hate me when I eat all this? Something like that. Bohemia, Saxony. The rest I don't think we care about too much. But Bohemia is worth keeping out, and so is Saxony, especially if he still has his union over Thuringia, and he does. Go get the war goal. Damn it, he annexed them. The guy died, so I can't get the second claim. Because my claims cost approximately infinite, because I already have claims on most of the other stuff. Let's activate the Siege Me slowly here, just in case he starts catching up the difference between 0 and minus 50. Stranger things have happened. And I probably... Actually, I probably take this so that I can revassalize him, honestly. Go rob them of their income by sitting on their not-a-gold mine. One bit of ally insurance on each of these seems sensible. Piss off the Pope by telling him he should live like a beggar. Has there been a change in available people? Yes! Aggressive expansion, go away man, 100%. See if our friends can finish them off. And if not, they should be at least weakened enough that round two is a victory. Perhaps even a squish. Because it is two to one. No such luck. Oh, and they also have the island still. Okay, call back. You go block here. And here. And here. Uh huh, their navy was stupid. Smush. Beautiful. Alright. Uh, Verdon, you willing to go away? If I blockaded you, that's a yes. Thank you. These can go back to earning us cash. Please and thank you. Okay, gather up down here and work out how we're adjusting this to take... Yeah, I need this so that I can act Novgorod again, but otherwise that's perfect. Done. And 
that's going to become Finland. So that next time we can use Reconquest, save some AE. Now I do need my claim on you. Which I've still got. Perfect. And because now our trust lasts... As long as the Muscovy won. He can't eat them before we can. Get rid of these horrible, horrible forts. Better. Okay, new mission. Ah, oh, quick giving me recover our manpower. No, we're going to pick one of the others. I need something that isn't recover our manpower. Okay, and start making the new minion love us. He doesn't want to be in our enemy. Neither are you. Beautiful. Maybe prevent you from wanting to be our enemy. Return cola. Oh, I gave it to the wrong person. Yes, true. That was meant to be mine, but whatever. I thought that was mine and it gave it to Novgorod instead. I understand what you're getting at. People had handed it over to the wrong person. means we're in a slight deficit, but we can fix that by getting rid of you. And then once these full core, we should be fine. Actually, I quite like that play of vassalizing him to give up to Muscovy. It makes it very, very simple to get Muscovy out of the... I've got the ducats for that. To get them out of the war. That is a bit less simple. Navy, here. Navy, here. This. Oh. Is Denmark not honouring? Denmark is not honouring. Well, that simplifies things. You can go back to training. You can go do whatever. The only real downside here is that I won't be able to lower autonomy. Uh, and my boats are a bit busy. I bet you don't invade my... my land, thank you. I want the nobles' influence down one. But we're one step. Actually, that brings us to the point where we can get rid of that one. They rebelled over here, which is a right pain in the backside to get to. cycle yet. It is not a new cycle. We can pre-raise. 
They are teleporting to Stuntviga. Go get underneath them. And if you can get ready to fix the pharaohs. I do need to full state everything. Buddy, do you want to help here? Okay. Get out. This is my land. Oh, we don't want to run away. Go away! I don't want to have to fight you. It's a waste of my manpower. have just stayed in their land I would have been happy to let them exist who else is going to be grumpy about eating this you yep <sighs> Maybe he's not piecing out because he wants that for him, which is all well and good. Okay, we enjoy three years of peace, and then we do our eat this bit of Denmark war. We'll take the galley combat ability. And otherwise just have... No, I was going to say patience, but we can get rid of this. And if we can, then we should. They again rebel on that stupid island. Let's assume they're going to run to here again. Yeah, Spread Street says no wants Pokemons. Remember people, contribute to the Pokemon Community Challenge. Twist my arm into playing some more Pokemons. If you enjoyed the other series, Infinite Fusion, Black and White, Diamond Pearl Platinum. We're up to playing Alpha Sun, or... The remakes of Sun and Sun and Moon. Or is it X and Y? I think it's Sun. I, I haven't. I never played Sun because I had Moon. So I want to play through Sun. Dear friend Poland pays off our debt. Aren't they a top friend? We've eliminated the Danish nobility.
Go kill them. Dip. Admin. Fix that. I wish I had the admin to stab up. <sighs> this is the default release, original 34. I have not updated because I quite like being able to do the little exploits that were built into the game to start with, and I don't see a reason to uh, update. The only reason to update, as far as I'm aware, is if you wanted to play Lithuania. That's worth doing once. Everything else is just not so important bug fixes or exploit fixes. Okay, you become auto ally, auto subject. That might be why rebels spawned here twice. Could be. These can go back to earning us money. We look at what month next year our truce with Denmark is. May. So in like January we want to turn this off. Okay, navies gather together. Two more months. Yeah, they love doing this this patch now. They tell Peskov to generate claims here and they get mission claimy things as well. And then they come eat this. Now it's next month, so we call this back. And we say dead Denmark. So what do I actually need? I need to own these ones and union him. Excellent trait to get. Minus aggressive expansion, just as we're about to take a huge hit of aggressive expansion. So I want. Sorry, what? Ah, they've changed the way this works. Okay. Yes, I'll pay the ducats to buy that manpower. I want this, this. Ooh. I didn't realise I wouldn't be able to do that. Uh, well, it looks like it works as long as this is Denmark. So I'll eat Lund, and he can keep everything else, right? There. Barely anyone hates me for this. Only Hamburg and Stetten. Stetten we're going to have a truce with. And I can try and keep Hamburg happy. Ooh, that is... That is a bit tempting at the moment. Maybe once this war is over. Willing to give in yet? 
Not quite. What if we were to blockade your friends? Not quite. What about you? That's a yes. And what about... No, that's enough percent. So I want this. I wouldn't mind some money. Chomp. Start making you love me. And we declare that this guy is also tasty food. No, they hate me enough. But they don't hate me enough that it matters in comparison to... This... Start making our new subject love us. These need repair. We need to bore you. We need to get rid of your fort. Well, actually, that fort's probably worth keeping. Because if they walk through here, it traps them, and then I can stack wipe them on the, the naval front. One bit of ally insurance of Hamburg. Okay, then how long till the truce with Sweden? Still like nine years. Okay. Gain restoration of the Union on Sweden. Okay. But more importantly... We can click this as soon as we own. This. And I'm actually going to have to give up Denmark and eat these. So what I do is I force one of these guys to make me give up Denmark in this war. And then we come eat him again for this bit. I'm going to need some more boats to actually land and kill him. 13 sounds wise. So you make me give up Denmark, please. You give me your cookies. Okay, I thought he had more units than than he does. I still need to wait for those boats, though. Just push Bayreuth out. Bayreuth, but I like Bayreuth. As long as Death Martian doesn't eat this bit, it's okay. I 
can always lend them some condos. To make sure they don't lose too hard. We're gonna scan the navs. We are gonna scan the navs. There we go. Blemon. Same deal. More abstract power cash. So 14 years I can finish this off. That doesn't time that poorly relative to eating the last of Sweden. Actually, at this rate, I should honestly truce break Denmark and Sweden. But eh, eh, someone else can optimize the truce breaking. claimed we wanted our freedom. We don't actually want it and we're going to complain about it after the fact. Wah! Yeah, now he's winning. So in retrospect, what I probably should have done instead is eat this, eat this, and made him spit out Holstein, but whatever. Yep, Death Martian is gone. Goatland is ours. They can have their autonomy because I don't want them to rebel. They're just a hassle to deal with. Okay. Make sure we're still married I've to heard you. there are jobs here. Uh, I want to be a lion tamer. Bang whoever she wants. And thank you, Birch. Like the tree? No, because it's with a U, not an I. Um, in any case, thank you kindly for the follow, mate. Hope you're having a lovely day. Yeah, you can have my cash. These can go back to earning us cash. Okay, I might as well get more favours with you in case you decide you don't want to join. I'm happy to sell out huge chunks of Lithuania to get Muscovy out of this next war. And the aim is... Reconquest this for you. Actually, it's just eat everything. And then annex Finland. And then I need this. Sure thing, you can have my sailors. Our advisors keep dying moments after I buy them. Oh yeah, now we got rid of those things, I can hand out the rest of these like normal. Um, so... You and 
you and you and the monarch point one. You're welcome, Birch. I have a good time. At least most of the time when I'm not struggling with horrible puzzles. Oh. Lund. Church, yes. The combination of sleep deprivation and puzzles was... was rough. Easier shortcutting, yes, exactly. Wait for the end of the month. Okay, and then that, and then that, and then that. New unit type. The uh, Denmark mission tree for doing the shortcutting is not really reasonable. The Sweden one needs you to conquer all of Pomerania and Prussia, whereas the Norway one just says eat Denmark and Sweden, which is what you naturally have to do anyway for the rest of the Scandinavia click button. So they are the natural choice. At least I think. You think they're not the natural choice? Join the EU4 speedrunning community and prove me wrong by doing it faster the other way. Okay, three years, and then Denmark. Who's the Emperor? Actually, if Arnsbach is the Emperor, we might as well... Uh... How big is this? Seven. Let's say that's ten, twenty, thirty... 40. I could eat all of that non-co-belligerently by attacking Stetten. As long as he isn't, like, friends with Austria or something. Bohemia is a bit of a Pain, but the rest is pretty manageable, I think, there. Especially considering the amount of favours you must owe me by now. Your laptop runs speed 4, leg like speed 2? Then do the in-game time once. Rather than the real time, rather than Mr. Timer, do the in-game date, date category once. This time of year is more like a pumpkin. It's spookier. Uh, I might as well get you some more favors as well then. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty. 70, 80, 90. Yep. It's still doable. I hate Denmark again, if that's allowed. It's not allowed. I don't want to hate any of these people and encourage them to ally my friends. I guess out of all of them, I would hate England the least. Just so that we're still getting the Monarch points. What's this? Are you attacking Novgorod? With Sweden's help? This might be a good opportunity to attack Sweden without Muscovy joining.
In any case, because my friends won't join against uh, this at the moment, it's, well, Burgundy will. Yeah, that might still be doable. Got a little bit over the force limit for this. Poland are at a distinct tech at disadvantage against Russia. No, I think I, I should go do this this first. Why did that go down? Oh, we've got the bugged spies. Yeah, we've got the bugged spies. So you've got to undo that and redo it. I should have noticed that earlier. Call back. Turn this off. Should have done this far earlier. Exclamation mark idiot. What month next year is the truce? In fact, it's already up. Ready, steady, go. Prepare for war. I'll declare over everything. You two join. Go. Muscovy's got the heavies. These need to learn to hide when at war. Okay, both of you go save this. Okay, that should be Verdon now. Ah, uh, bullshit. No, not bullshit. He had tech six and I didn't. Fair enough.
Slightly too slow. Boo hiss. Okay, that should be enough to get you out, maybe. If we were blockading you, yes. Let's see if we can get away with that. Thank you. And next. actually went a lot worse than I would have imagined. It is going to be pain to get Muscovy out of this. Far out. Retreat to where you were told to, you stupid units. Grrr. Grrr.
Actually, that's potentially really good. Not if that happens. This was meant to be that Russia was sick and tired of the other war. Wait, you're really assaulting this? Yeah, they're really assaulting that. Head over to Moscow. Okay, and Luki. Don't care about my boats. Can I get you to give up something sensible? No. There's nothing they want. Well, they would want war reps, but then they say, I don't want gold. What about now? Sitting on a second fort. Close. Three. Two. If he joined me there, I could ram that. Thank you. Sudden war score is all in our favour. There's no longer 800 million stupid Russian forts in the fight. And all his subjects. Hmm. 
No. Your navy dies. Everyone here. And then here. Good. Hand over as much of this to me as possible rather than our guy. If I have to core it, it's annoying, but why can't I hand? Oh, because it's already mine. But it means that I have the right number of provinces and I don't have to wait for the cores to finish. On as many other things. You, 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 you. Yes, done. Chomp. Okay, we start getting rid of you. We hope that Austria hasn't won the election in the meantime. We trust you down. We trust you down. We trust you down. No, we don't, because we want to prepare you for war. All of these guys, come help us eat Denmark. Weisstetten. As long as he hasn't suddenly gotten better friends... No, that should be doable. Wrong guy. You. Go. Morning, morning, morning. Okay. You know what? You go there. So that they can't block us moving. As always, Poland is obsessed with the Teutonic Order. Oh look, there's the Teutonic Order to siege. Nothing else could possibly matter half as much as that. The colonies attack natives? Yeah, if you haven't done the... um. There's an event that basically says, do you want your colonies to be able to expand freely or not, that you'll get. We blockade you, you'll probably immediately say yes. Good day to you. And then you. At least once that fight is done. What's going on here? Lundberg is what's going on here. You can't remember that event? It basic there, it's like cost prestige or I think it's cost prestige or No, it's opinion of the natives or your minions hate you a bit. Your CNs. Okay, so what I want here is this, 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 and then that. Stockholm is... sorry. Stockholm is coring. And I need these, which is what we're working on right now. Get rid of you. We successfully annexed this guy.
They're all concentrating on poor Burgundy. We lost Brabant when I wasn't looking. If you would just do a little bit of carpet sieging. I can't piece out this guy because he's the actual primary person. Sorry, France. <laughs> I mean, sorry, Burgundy, but we're done after this. Goodbye, Bohemia. Lundberg, Saxony, and Brunswick. So, AI France has correctly detected that I'm not willing to fight that fight. Not while I'm busy with this one. <laughs> Saxony's really making this a bit of a pain. Yeah, 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 but we don't care about that once this is done. Come on, I have three of your provinces. Ugh. We don't want a piece out. you give up that siege? Oh, that hurts. It's my fault for not putting ally insurance on it, but it still hurts. And if you're going to force me to full siege you, then you get to lose every single relationship that you have. Same with you. Welcome to No Friends Town, population you. They might actually let me peace out for the war score thing that I want right now. That's a yes. I just need Viestland to core and we're done. Yes, they won't declare a war whilst they're in another war, but the AI will never declare a war. Well, not never. But almost never declare a war when they're in another war. The exceptions, the obvious exceptions are event wars, so things like the Surrender of Maine, and um, they will contest PUs, but that's it. That's pretty much it. Everything else, they will not start a second war when they're already in one.
These can all have their autonomy. The only thing that matters is finishing the core. So if they rebel and slow down the core, terrible. If they don't rebel, fantastic. As long as we don't literally bankrupt, we're fine. Yes, because I wanted... Whatever. Yep. And then done. One hour thirty two. Sure, have the new ambitions. Look at the newly expanded mission tree, I think. <laughs>